Hello, I'm David. Hi, I'm Julie. Now we're going to do a how to play and playthrough of Mountain Goats by All Play Games. This is for two to four players. It takes about 20 minutes for ages eight and up. And it says here about one minute to teach, which is pretty accurate. Yeah. So we played this at Dice Tower West mm -hmm. uh, 2024. And not only did we buy it, but my brother bought one as well. Yep. So this is a push your luck, score the most points game. Uh, King of the Hill. You set up these number cards, 5 through 10 as follows, with different chips. This is what you're going to be collecting when you get your goat to the top here. You'll see how many there are in the stack here. So 12, 5, 11, 6s, 10, 7s, 9, 8s, 8, 9s, and 7, 10s. The game will end when three of those stacks are gone, or if all the bonus tiles have been awarded. And we're not playing with these goats here because this is a two-player game. It can play, like I said, up to four players, although you can get a fifth-player expansion. So the way the game works is you're going to be rolling the four dice. And you can combine these dice into groups. You can... But they have to be match these numbers. If it's less than five, you're not going to go anywhere. So I can make this six and five, for instance. I can make it nine it? and not use the two. Mm -hmm. I can make it seven and not use the four. Uh, so those are the combination with those dice. If it was now, if I made it eleven, I'm not going anywhere because I can't move. There's no eleven mountain. If you do roll ones, the first one you cannot modify. If you roll two or more ones, you can modify one of the ones at any side you want. So if I really want to get move my ten up, I could do this and move the ten up, but I wouldn't be able to use these. If I did roll three ones, I can modify two of them, but you always must, when you roll two or more ones, you must always keep one of the ones a one. So you move up into the white mountains, you can share spaces with other goats and you don't get any points. If a goat gets here to the top, so if I got up to the top right there, I take a five point chip. And if I stay there, I can continue getting that five point chip. If Julie moves up there, she kicks me down, she gets a five point chip, and and then I would have to move my way up back to kick her off the top. <laughs> so it's easier, less turns it takes to get up to the 10, but you got to use more dice to get a 10. As you know, you can get a 5 with just one die. Now, how do you get these bonus tiles? If you get a complete set of 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, you can, the first one that does that gets a 15. The next person that does that, even the same person, if they manage to get two sets, and get to 12. So again, the game will end when all four sets are gone or three stacks are depleted. So Julie will go first. Okay, so I have two tens. Really? Yeah, six. Oh wait, no. You have an eight and a 10. Eight and a 10, sorry. This is why he has to watch me. <laughs> I get too excited. And my mouth isn't as swift as it should be. <laughs> I'm just moving the picture in picture here. Okay. Okay. So here we are down here. So we're gonna. I'm gonna roll here. Oh. Oh my goodness. So I can move two sixes and a nine, which I will do. That's Oops. five. Those are fives. Okay, your turn. All right. Eight, nine, ten. So you're not going to move that one. Nope. So Julie just got a 10-point chip. Why don't you put it right here? I'm trying my best here. Here we go. Okay. So Julie's score pile will be right over here. Okay, here I go. Nine. I can do six and seven, which I think I will do. Your turn. Hmm. I'll do another 10. Okay, so Julie's using that, not using the one. I'm not doing too good in terms of points right now. Six and seven. Yeah, but okay. you're getting more different ones than I am, so you are doing well. Yeah, but you have right now 20 points to my six. All right, I'm going to go six twice and then a seven. Okay. 10 and 10. Oh, Ooh, I get kicked off. That's when you do it. Yep. 
Okay, I'll do uh, eight. That's me. Sorry. You're okay. Eight and a seven. Okay. Maybe move me up. That's great for me. <laughs> I, I get a nine, nice. and I use the second nine, so I get two nines. Very good, honey. Yeah, that was major strategy there. I know. <laughs> there is some strategy in here, what you move up when you look at the odds. I'm going to do seven. And trying to get sets. That's me. Sorry. There you go. Seven. And then do the nine. And a nine. There we go. Okay, and put your chip here. Oh, yeah. Ooh, okay, so I can change it to what I want. So I definitely want to get another 10. But I will not be able to use these dice. That's okay. I'd rather get a 10. That's right. Because those are going to get depleted pretty fast here. Eight. Don't forget you have a 7 already. So you can make a 7. Oh, yeah. Thank you. S 7 and 6. Correct. Yep, and you move it up. I'll move you up there. Okay, my turn. All right, well, I'm going to make that a six. And I'll get another ten. Darn it. So now we're, I have more tens have more. than you do. Yep. Basically, eight and nine. Eight and nine, thank you. So you kick me off. But now you're closer to getting a set. You just need to get your seven, six, and five. No, you just need to get a six and a five. Oh, yeah, I got a ten again, but nothing else. I got it. Your turn. I'm not going to get any more tens, I don't think. Now, you may wonder what happens when a pile is depleted, what happens to your goat. Well, you keep your goat at the top of the mountain, and it can be used to break ties if you have the same scores. So you can still battle just in case there's a tie at the end of the game. All right, well, I didn't get... Oh, no, I got a 10. And there's a 5. Okay, the 10s are gone. Your turn. Are you going to bother getting 10s anymore? Because there's nothing to get. Right. Doesn't mean I got a bunch of 10s the last time we played, and I still lost. Because if you get the bonus tiles, mm -hmm. that's what really can help. 7 and 8. I'm going to kick you off. Okay. And then i got to move my 8. I moved you up. Okay. So i got to get an 8 and a oh, 5. Oh, look at this, Mo. All right, well, you can change three of them to whatever you want. Okay. Um, so if you look here, you probably want to get a 6. And, yeah. And you can do two fives if you want to get the uh, bonus tile. You can okay. change one to a 6. All right. And like then that? make two fives. Okay. So you could have just changed this to a 6 and not used a 1, but that's fine. So you go here, you kick me off. Okay. Okay. And you get two fives. So now you have a complete set. So you get to 15. So this is how Julie will, I'll move this up, can make up for the fact that she doesn't have as many tens as me. Yeah. Now if she gets another nine, six, and five, she'll get a 12. She can only make two complete sets now because she only has two tens. Yeah. But, uh, so that makes up for her not getting all those tens. Five, six, okay. I need to get fives. And I can get a six here. All right, go ahead. So the only thing I'm, I need an eight, too. So I can get that 12 before Julie. So you can change one of those ones to whatever you want. And I'm going to stop helping you because uh, you're doing pretty good now. Two, eight. <laughs> And uh, I'll do a six. Okay. Oh, no, I'll do a five because you're getting close right, so to you're getting making, me. So you're making it a four. Yeah. Don't be jealous. So you make that a four. Sorry. It's okay. I just want to show the audience that's what you would have done. I'm uh, glad I did that. I need a nine. I already have nines. I can't do tens. No, because you I took can do them three all fives. Little piggy. Okay, that's what I'll do. One. And then, so I get three fives in that row. In that. Nice. So I just need to get an eight. So six, seven, eight. And you get a six. And then a six. Thank you. Okay. I need to get eights. 
So I'm removing up here, and I'll get another five. Your turn. I need to get a nine. Oh, so you're making another set there off to the side. Six. If you're going to do that, then do this. Yeah. I hope you remember. Did you get it? Yeah. Wow. So that's the thing. You might think Julie's not doing too well with all the tennis, but she just got both bonus tiles. That's how she beat me last time. Okay. Got to watch out for those quiet ones. I got to get I got to get the eight. Well, okay, I got to do that. I won't be using that three, but at least I got the eight. Good job, babe. And you beat me to that twelve. Do you get a nine? Yeah. At least I got another nine. I got that bonus. Nice job. I can't get the six. I, I'm done. Yeah, you can't get any more bonus tiles. So what you're going to want to do is deplete these piles as quick as possible to end the game sooner. Because before I get that six. Nine. Okay, so just make stacks, honey. Put all oh. your stuff in a stack. Okay. Oh. All right, so two sevens, huh? I'll get the two sevens. Your turn. Now you can change one of those ones into what you ever you want. Um, Put it up over here. Six and six. So I get one, wow, two, three, three sixes. sixes. That's eighteen points. Okay. I need to get another six, another eight. I'm really far down here. I will change this to a six. Six six. Number of the beast. That's right. Well, it's three sixes, actually. <laughs> or maybe it's nine, nine, nine. Nine. Really? Yeah. I think you're going to beat me. She's got a lot of stacks here. If you want to <laughs> see from the side there, her stacks are a lot bigger. Than, I mean, I may have a lot of tens, but right there. Okay. Let's do a little side camera movement here. Hey. Uh... Seven and seven. There you go. Well, I can't pass that up. No, that's what I would do. I can always get because I, I, uh, we're not going to be playing stacks too quickly here, so I'm going to get the sevens. I've got two ones again. Well, you can change it to whatever you want. Uh, can I just get two, two sixes? sixes? I'll do two yeah. sixes. Hey, you don't have to. Okay. Okay, so here. I have three sixes yep. and a two. Okay, I'm going to get three sixes. You go back down here. So I get all three. So now we have two stacks. And now I got, oh, I need another, I need an eight. So hang on. Oh, I'm sorry. If Julie's able to deplete a stack here, got two nines, the game will end, but we get an equal number of turns. You went first, right? Mm -hmm. So there's an equal number of turns. So Julie can still try to stop me. From getting this six, if she can deplete that knot, those two nines. But she won't. Oh, you can get one nine. Like four. Here, put it right here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Awesome. Okay. So I got to get there. Oh, no, I need an eight. I need another eight. You got it. No, you didn't. Yes, you did. Yes. You got two fours. I have to do that. Otherwise, I will not be competitive. Good job. Okay. So you can end it right here. Get the last nine. All right. So I get equal number of turns. Yep. At least I'm up here. Yeah. Hopefully, I can get some an eight and a seven. A nine, a five, and a six. That's really crappy. I can get two fives. A ten doesn't help me. I can get a six. Okay, but there's six no sixes. So moving up there fives. doesn't matter. I guess I'm going to get two fives. That's it. That's it. Only ten points this round. All right, but if there's a tie, I'm definitely going to be break the tie. Oh, yeah. Now I have to get my calculator out. Okay. So Joey's going to count up, and I'm going to count up here. I want to make stacks of uh, 50. Let's do that. 50. Hmm. 
Hmm. It'd be hard to. Oh, here we go. Okay, I think I have my count. Let me just make sure of this one. Okay. What did you get? Uh, 178. 199. <laughs> yeah, that seems about right. Uh, because you had so many. Yeah. Uh, let's make sure. I'm just going to look real quick Oh, here. sure, sure. Stop to the side here. If we look here. I did it with my calculator. No, you're okay. I'm sure you're all right. 27. Okay, nine. 54. 64. 74. This can be definitely uh, work on your math. 74. 84, 90, 90, 102, 117, 117, 123, 129, 135, 141, 147, 153, 160, 160 plus 32. 192, yep, 199. See, I thought you would win. Good job doing it that way. It's real hard with my cognitive disability well, to do that. It's not easy for me anymore either. Okay. Thank goodness for calculators so, on your phone. <laughs> getting all the tens aren't necessarily the best thing to do. I, the second time I've lost, it's getting yeah. those bonuses that kicked my butt. So that's how you play Mountain Goats. So fun. Uh, please check out our review, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. All right, bye-bye.